Welcome back. The Maine Endwell Boys Swimming and Diving Program recently took home yet another Section 4 championship. However, it's the street that they find themselves in that is truly remarkable. It's a family, it's a tradition, and if we can continue going through, it'll be amazing. As Sam Romanowski said, the Maine Endwell Boys Swimming and Diving Program is indeed a family, with each member willing to do whatever it takes to win for one another. As far as tradition goes, that revolves around one thing and one thing only, winning. The Spartans captured their 10th consecutive Section 4 championship last week, the longest such streak in the section's Class B division, capping off a decade of dominance. It's really special to just be a part of like that clean number 10. You know, we've had a whole decade of success at this point, and it just it feels special that I got to be a part of such a big win. You know, they're all big, but I feel like this one was you know, especially important in our run. Maximus DeLuca has a point, considering for months the team wasn't even sure they were going to have a season at all. Luckily, they were given the green light to proceed, but that didn't mean the challenges went away. We've had our downfalls. Like, I had to quarantine for two weeks in the middle of the season, so even coming back and, like, getting back into things, it was... Uh, everyone helped me through it, you know. However, through it all, the team banded together and took care of business when it counted the most. While this year's section championships were held virtually at each school's respective pools, that didn't change the mindset for Alexander Yonishi and his teammates. We are all extremely focused and just really determined to get the win for another year. We don't let ourselves lose to anybody, especially as sectionals. It's just it's becoming a tradition. And that word surfaces again. And it's something that is certainly in the minds of Gavin Fanning and Billy Gorman, both underclassmen and tasked with carrying on the tradition for years to come. Uh, it's really important. Uh, everybody has worked their hardest through the years, and if we keep working hard, then we're going to continue to win. You know, it's, uh, it's a lot of pressure on you to keep it going, but uh, hopefully you, you know, we, we work hard and hopefully we keep it going. Talking with this team, you can feel how important this tradition is to them and that it's understood what needs to be done to keep it going. As long as that mindset continues, so will the tradition. We'll be